Time now, 6.05. Wake Up Central, of course, committed to keeping you safe and sound. And in just a couple of weeks, you know a rare event will occur in the sky. People in parts of the U.S., including Arkansas, will be able to witness a total solar eclipse. Others may see a partial eclipse. To view the sun, though, you have to have proper eyewear. And experts are warning now that fakes are on the market and they could do damage to your eyes. Danya Backus visited a legitimate manufacturer and has some tips on how to make sure that your glasses are safe. And then Chloe's putting together our pillow box product. It's a busy time at Rainbow Symphony in Los Angeles. Mark Margolis's company is shipping out glasses for the solar eclipse. That's a couple of weeks away, but he's been making glasses for two years. How many glasses have you produced over what the last two years? Two years. Really tens of millions of pairs. Yeah. His glasses are made in the U.S., come with an ISO seal, and are certified with the number 12312-2. However, experts are warning that foreign companies are making fakes. The American Astronomical Society says one or more unidentified factories in China are now producing counterfeit eclipse glasses. This counterfeit pair looks very similar to the real thing, and on the inside, it even has the correct number in the name of a legitimate American manufacturer. We know that there are counterfeits, which may or may not be safe, and we know that there are fakes, which I define as being unsafe. So how do you know if your glasses are safe? NASA offers this advice. Take your eclipse glasses and find a bright light, like a lamp or a flashlight. Hold your eclipse glasses up to the light and look through them. The light will appear extremely dim or not appear at all when looking through the glasses. Eclipse glasses are at least a thousand times darker than the very darkest ordinary sunglasses. On its website, the American Astronomical Society lists authorized dealers that sell safe glasses. We've been working long hours during the week and then also on weekends. Margolis says supplies are going quickly, so shoppers might want to buy soon before the glasses, like the sun, disappear. Danya Backis, CBS News, Los Angeles.